Hi, it's Nat Hoy from Red Fox Property Group and today I'm at 178 Rosebury Street in Bedford. The top three things we love about this property. Number one, location, south of Grand Prom, Inglewood Primary School Zone and Inglewood Border. More on that later. Number two is the secure outdoor spaces like this gorgeous front courtyard and all of the area down the side. I'll show you that shortly. And number three is the house itself. Really great practical floor plan, nice character features, really super tidy and move in ready as is, but with an opportunity to add further value down the track. Let's go and have a look around. We're in the formal entry and as you can see, Jarrah floorboards and high ceilings as we expect in these mid-century character homes. Over here to the right, we've got the first of the bedrooms, bed one, which you'd probably use as the main bedroom. We've got a beautiful big bed there, bed sides. You can see all of the space you've got either side. We've got a bank of three robes here. If you wanted um, certainly permanent robes, you could put all of that in. You've got a heap of wall space to be able to do it. Um, plenty of space there in the corner. All of this room here, if you wanted to, again, have tall boys or extra storage there. And you've got these lovely French doors that go out to the front courtyard as well. Across the hallway, we have the second bedroom. So second bedroom, all the bedrooms, in fact, are a great size. So beautiful room, the Jarrah boards, the nice high ceilings. You can see we've got the beautiful picture rails here, a fan there. And this has got um, one of those great bunk beds with the double bed at the bottom and the single at the top. And you can see how much extra space there is. So again, another really well proportioned room. Um, plenty of room here for a robe. And if you want to put built-ins there, you can as well. Linen here in the entry. Kitchen dining I'll do in a sec. We'll just do the third bedroom. Um, we don't have this one staged or styled. Um, but again, the fabulous proportions. Check out the floor plans online. You'll see all of the dimensions a really good size room. Kitchen, there's meals, there's also space for dining over there, but this is a really big room. So you could, if you wanted to, have one of those gorgeous farm style kitchen tables there in the middle. Um, we've got a little high, um, which I love this. It's a combined kind of workbench with shelving, but also sort of um, like has the breakfast bar side for stools there, which I think is really practical and a really great addition. You could have an island bench in there if you wanted to as well. There's just plenty of space. We've got the nice olive green shaker cabinetry, good sized fridge recess there, overhead cupboards, the timber look bench tops, double sink, dishwasher, which is a melee. Again, more overhead cupboards there and stove there in what would have been the old stove nook. So just a really lovely kitchen with those beautiful kind of rustic character features. And then we've got the open plan living dining space. So this has obviously been the old sleep out, which over time has been punched out and extended. Um, so we've got a beautiful, nice, big size living space here. More than enough room for meals there. French doors outside to get lots of nice of light through the back of this property. We've got bathroom and we've got an extra toilet. So I love the fact that you've got the two loos. So shower with the um, semi-frameless uh, shower screen. There's a new vanity there and the loo. So really super tidy bathroom. And we've got a second loo here. And laundry is just tucked around off the side over here as well. So just out of the way there. So beautiful proportions, really nice space, light and bright, very open. So it's got a really nice flow and feel to the property. Before we head inside, we'll take a tour outside. So the first thing to know is that all of this front courtyard here, which I'm standing in, is fully fenced. So it is fantastic and secure. You've got these beautiful gardens with the snake plants, the gorgeous frangipanis that are in flower, hibiscus, 
all really lovely low maintenance nice little patch of lawn grevillea over there and then this beautiful big sort of courtyard raised courtyard area there there is a pull out blind um, at the moment we've also got the umbrella there if you wanted to you could put in a more permanent alfresco structure subject to council approval of course out here as well and that's french doors that go into the main bedroom so you've got lovely access to the front yard from there formal entrance is tucked around in here so that goes into the property there but before we go inside i'm going to show you the rest of the outside there's this great big double carport again secure from the street all enclosed absolutely love it the roof structure up there so if you've got extra bits to store you can pop them up there you've got though a nice closed shed here and when we go through this gate so you can section off the front and the back you'll see that there's another garden shed out here as well so another garden shed tucked here behind the gate and then you can see all this fabulous space down the side and what I love about this is the future opportunities so we've got the garden shed so obviously that doesn't have to stay if you don't need two big sheds that one can go and you've got even more room we've got room for a big tramp here we've got the cubby there and this wall here where the um, hanging is for the laundry you could put some French doors there and open up that living space as well which would just be fantastic so if I come back to that corner you can see all of this space down the side and imagine how much there is if that other garden sheds removed but of course if you need it you've got the plenty of room for it as well which is a bonus and if we come around this leads to the back of the house and those doors go straight into the living area so great opportunity here to add further value down the track location you're just 6k's from the city 600 meters from walter road west and 1k from beaufort street so getting around is easy as pie you're 300 meters around the corner from the bedford iga you've also got popular our table restaurant there and new small bar Django's, which is sure to become a fave inglewood primary school zone inglewood border south of grand prom what is not to love Call me now 0405 812 273 for more details or we'll see you at a home open. Have a great day.